morning, guys. Day two. Day two, day two. Okay, things are going good. It's already, it's almost 10 o'clock. Getting the day started. Got a kid off to hockey practice. Got breakfast made for everybody else. I'm fasting. I've got my coffee going. Life is good. Um, I actually woke up not feeling hungry at all. Dinner was so filling last night. I was like, Ugh. I made my kids some keto ice cream too, and I thought, maybe I'll have a bite of it. No, I was like, that ain't worth it. I'm going to feel sick. So anyway, I got my, I'm just drinking some coffee right now with some heavy whipping cream. So that is my kind of go-to. I sip on it all morning so that I don't break my fast. Cause like the whipping cream does have calories in it, but if you sip it over a long period of time, it doesn't break your fast. So do that, do that. <laughs> so anyway, um, to keep myself busy, I'm gonna be going to uh, the store running a few errands with my daughter and so that'll that'll be good to get some time you know do a little bit of shopping so you can't you know go around with like post Christmas sales at the bottom so that's what I'm gonna do and then I am going to be making the burgers tonight so I know that like Jess has said you know do with what you do with what works for you so I'm still gonna be utilizing all the recipes in her plan however sorry about the glare guys super snowy out um, but I've just adjusted when I'm gonna be eating them um, the different foods just to adjust our schedule because we have two boys in hockey that keep us busy and school stuff and whatever else going on so I spilled my coffee so I was like let's take care of that um, so that's what I'm doing so like last night we did so for day two it's supposed to be grilled chicken and veggies but I did that yesterday and so tonight I'm gonna to be doing burgers with fried egg to pickles avocado blah 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 so we're gonna do that tonight because it'll be way easier so okay 130 and I'm gonna break my fast with I've got some bacon more eggs avocado and I'm gonna have some of these olives mm with some tzatziki sauce from Aldi. So I'm really gonna enjoy that. I am super excited. I think I've definitely earned this uh, meal after this extended fast. Yum. All right guys, so my lunch is down the hatch and now, now I am gonna have a shake. So one brand that I really like actually is the Perfect Keto. This is the one, let me get some more light here so you guys can see what I'm talking about. This one, and I like the chocolate one. I'm not like a super huge fan of the vanilla, but this one's really good. I put a scoop of it in with almond milk and ice and blend it up. Call it a day. It's delicious. And it's kind of nice to have like a chocolate fix in a way, but not like break the bank on the macros. So like the sweetener in it, I think is just stevia. So oh, it's all covered up by a sticker. Thanks, Amazon. But anyway, I think it's just like sweetened by stevia, which is really nice. So that is good. So I'm going to blend that up. And enjoy and then we're gonna watch some mandalorian i mean it's a saturday why not right it's fun and it's freezing outside i mean like right no bueno all right guys here are the burgers okay so we have five people in our family and i did make extra because i wanted some for lunches on the alternate days on the menu so, and I did make them a bit bigger because I'm like, then one should be pretty much enough. So, and I always do about one pound of burger meat per, um, per one pound of burger meat, I add one egg. And then with this one, I added a, a butter burger uh, seasoning. So this should be really, really good. So I'm really looking forward to it. So we have the grill. Here, here. I've got my little <laughs> charger here. So the grill is getting ready to go there. So yeah, we grill all year round. <laughs> That's our thing. And then this is like what things are looking like for us in, in Wisconsin. So got plenty of snow and all the things. You know, life is good, right? Life is good. So there you go. What do you guys think about these weight loss health journeys? I know for me, I was still like overweight as a kid and all that kind of stuff and so like I feel like I've been on a diet or some kind of routine or whatever since like my beginning of time 
Like, I feel like that's always been it. And sometimes I just get so tired. But, like, I know it's important. And I know that keto works. So, and I need to try and keep pushing through and knock it down on myself. Because I think, too, let me unplug this. I think, too, that, um, yeah, just got to keep pushing through, right? And keep going. And just know that. If I keep focused, if I keep diligent and have patience, that things will work out. So, positivity, positivity. So, anyway. Use number four.